So in today's video we're going to talk about the Works Hydro Shot. Basically it's a cordless pressure washer. You can take anywhere, you can use on a normal hose pipe or use the pipe that it comes with with any water supply whether it's out of a bucket or a river or a lake or whatever um, to basically wash down your car, your boat, anything you want. Uh, it's quite a sturdy little device, you know, it's well made, uh, it's fairly lightweight, uh, it comes with a little extender rod so you can use it um, away from you so you don't get splash back um, and a multi kind of jet end as well. So you can have uh, water in a 40 degree angle, 25 degree angle, 15 and then basically a straight nozzle out. 15 is about the average that I've used it on. It works out all right. So various options there of what you can do and how you can use it. Uh, the device itself, like I say, it's just got a sort of standard hose lock type connector at the bottom there so everything fits in. So a 20 volt battery. The battery will last about 30 to 35 minutes in total. It takes two to two to three hours to give it a full charge. It's got a high and a low feature. So what I thought I'd do is clean my front wheel. Basically, the car's not been cleaned for about a week. So I thought, you know, give the wheel a clean and half of it, I'm going to use my Karcher pressure washer and half of it, I'm going to use the Works pressure washer. So you can see exactly, you know, side by side, how well they each do. So I've used the Karcher for about a year or two, so it's not an expensive one, but you know, it's a decent one, uh, works well, no problem whatsoever, clean my car with it all the time, and it's connected to mains water. Uh, the Works HydroShot is basically, like I say, just a, a little hose that comes with it, and that's just in a little bit of water there in the bucket. So first up is the uh, Works washer, and um, it's okay, I mean, it sounds a bit noisy, um, but actually, uh, you'll hear it in a minute, it's just basically about a third less noisy than the Karcher. Um, but it's doing a really good job. I was quite surprised, you know, it's clearing all the muck off. Yeah, there's some stains on the wheel that, you know, they're going to take um, a cloth or a scrubbing brush and that to get off. But just to get all the muck off straight away, it's doing quite a good job, really. Fairly easy to, you know, kind of use, nothing special you needed about it. Turn the tyre off. And then that's half of it done, so let's get to the Karcher. Obviously the Karcher's working at a much higher pressure. That's how we get the lots of splash back on the camera. Um, like I say, to me it sounds noisier as well. So, um, I guess, you know, the motors inside the Karcher are working on mains um, electricity as well and mains water. And it's doing a lot more jobs, so it uh, sounds, uh, sounds louder as well. So let's have a look now. So we're doing close-ups on the wheels. Now, uh, um, obviously they're not totally clean. I didn't really expect that, but you can see that it's shifted a lot of dirt. A lot of the uh, surface muck and everything's come off. And if you look at that, that's the first part of half and half, and there's not really any difference really. I was um, I was quite surprised actually how well the works um, hydro shot did. You know, looking at that side by side, you can't tell which side's been cleaned with a, uh, you know, mains water and a mains electricity pressure washer like a Karcher. Little marks there where it looks like the hydro shot, basically um, as the pumps work in, there's just little sort of um, distances between the jets of water. So if you sort of use it really quickly across the surface, you get to see those markings. But other than that, you know, that's done an exceptional job. It's literally sort of the same either side of the wheel, really. So I thought I'd give it a go on the lintel at the front of the house. Uh, it's not been cleaned for about a year, so half of it on the left-hand side I did with the Karcher again. Um, and obviously the right-hand side I'm doing with the uh, Works. And as you can see, it's doing exactly the same job. There's no difference on there. Um, just to make you know, oh, it's got high and low on it as well. Um, so if you turn it on to low pressure, Obviously you get less coming out there, it's a little bit quieter, but it still quite surprisingly does a really good job even on low pressure. So uh, easy enough, change it again, whoosh, back onto high pressure, and then you know works a lot faster, a lot easier. But like I say, side by side you can't tell the difference in whether it's a wheel or you know cleaning the grime off the window lintel there. 
So this thing is really good, you know, it's side by side comparison between this and a full blown Karcher. Um, it's so good and the fact that you can use this everywhere, you know, whether you're using it on a boat or cleaning your bike somewhere or caravan, motorhome or at home, you know, and you've just got no power supply near you, no mains water, it's great. So thanks very much for watching my video today, I hope you liked it, please give it a thumbs up if you did and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. See you soon, bye.